All right. So Wylan starts. Fantastic. All right. Your Majesty, shall we open court? Uh, yes, please. Thank you. People of Eldermere, draw nigh and pay heed as we are assembled today to witness the court of King Britannicus, steadfast in battle, and his beloved Queen Isabel, more radiant than the dawn. They who bind us together in these trying times, here opens their court. Your Majesties have asked everyone to please remain muted during court. Um, anybody that wishes to uh, have something to say, please use the chat button and we will address it after court is finished. Your Majesties. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you everybody for coming today. Um, this is our first virtual court. Um, it, it's very exciting and still kind of a um, little bit, a little bit sad to do it this way. But we are so happy to see everybody here today and thank you so much for being here. So um, I think uh, we're going to start with a couple of quick announcements. Uh, we know everybody is anxious to um, get back together and have meetings and events and practices. Um, obviously, as the mundane authorities allow us to open things up, we will. The Privy Council, just so that everybody knows, the Privy Council will be uh, meeting next week via Zoom to uh, discuss um, what reopening looks like. So hope there should be very, very soon a plan in place. Um, it'll be similar to kind of the guidelines that the, uh, the province is putting out here, but it's coming. Hopefully soon we'll get to meet together, even if it's just for a meeting or an a &S day. So that's very exciting. Exactly. Um, else. Oh, um, we put it in the tidings last month. It's, or this month, July, it'll be in the August tidings as well. Um, just a quick note that we have extended the deadline for applications and uh, people um, for our crown tournament. Um, the deadline has been extended to September 20th, which is a Sunday um, at 11.59 p.m. September 20th. So lots of time if uh, people would like to put in. Uh, we know that um, it's very different uh, what our successors, our heirs uh, reign will look like. Um, and uh, hopefully we'll be able to have a crown tournament in October. Elder Mary, you've been doing so many amazing things uh, from mass making to being frontline workers to being essential services, um, to teaching classes online, to running entire events online. Um, you make us so proud. And I think we'd like to do this today. Okay. Your Grace, if you could please uh, do the thing, that would be great. Their Majesties wish it known that the following people have been placed upon the scroll of honor. First and foremost, the frontline and essential workers, Lady Abilene Campbell, Lady Bayock, Baron Dimitri, Lady Dorthe Dortea Othholm, Lord Ewan Ap Willem, Lady Cassia Hapilin, Lady Kiva McLeod, Baroness Kurskakin, Lord Martin Brewer, Lady Morag Taylor, Sir Sahid Al Hassan, Baroness Ursula Naklan Naroth, Knigi Gina, Christiane, Christina Biatcha Slavovna. They also wish it known that the following people who have donated caps or masks or gowns also be placed upon the scroll of honor. Sir Elfwyn Langawood, Mistress uh, Abilene Kennard for Sky, Dame Anne of Saffron Walden, Baroness Anne Tinker, Countess Arlette de Sals, Lady Bera Odd's daughter, Lord Bjorn uh, Jarnson, Lady Brunhild uh, Nall daughter, Bartonina Caitlin Ingen Thomas uh, U. Durham, Lady Deidre Galbraith, Dame Eleanor Cadfan, Sir Elizabeth Mortimer, Her Ladyship Emmer Ingen O. Aiden, Baroness Gemma, Countess Je uh, Jean Pierre Chasteline d'Anjou, Dame Helen of Greyfells, Countess Hurokin, Lady Isabella von Saxon, Countess Yulisha of Litchfield, Her Ladyship Laura Batista, Mistress L Lucia de Ininza, 
Baroness Mahilde de Vulgar Vulgarns, Countess Marion Golightly, Lady Mary of Cairdreath, Baroness Mahilda de Swinford, Magistrate Nicola de Bracton of Leicestershire, Lady uh, Regna Hather Hor's uh, daughter, Mistress Rosalinda Thornby on Tess, Baroness Skaya Ingen Chengen, uh, His Lordship uh, Balder Yarnsmith, and Widow Kate of the Lake. Thus say their majesties. Wassail! Wassail, everyone. We received um, so many names, and there are so many, many more names to be added to that list. Um, we also, uh, to try and keep the list a little shorter today, um, we have not included other people who will, we would like to recognize as well at a later date. So um, for those people doing classes, for those people that have been involved in all of the online, um, all the online stuff, the videos, the Eldermere at home, all of those things, um, send us those names because you guys have been just simply amazing. And you are the reason that Eldermere is, is still feeling like we're present and being here and doing the thing. So um, send us more recommendations, more names, and there will be more in a future court. Um, we, we look forward to the scribes uh, putting the biggest list to scroll the water ever. <laughs> so, Wassail of Eldermere. Wassail. So, and we I have Officer Changeovers. Excellent. Eldermere, please be aware that Mistress Irony Omar's daughter has relinquished her position as Rapier Marshal for Eldermere and is being. Uh, t the office is being taken over by his lordship, uh, Kurishimo uh, Yoshi, 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 so, uh, often called Yoshi. Also, be it known that uh, Kaninga Ganina Christina Viatchis Lavova has uh, finished her term as Kingdom Minister of Arts and Science and has been succeeded by her ladyship, Emilo of Calais. A sale to all officers, incoming and outgoing. A sale. Thank you very much, Your Grace. Um, thank you to Ernie for being our Kingdom Reaper Marshal for the last couple of years. You've done an amazing job. Um, big shoes to fill for Yoshi, but I'm sure that he'll do an amazing job as well. Um, thank you also for staying on uh, as the youth Rapier Marshal. Uh, at this time, Annie, uh, you've done an amazing job getting that film in. Thank you very much. And to uh, um, Christinia, thank you so very much. You were amazing uh, to work with as the uh, Kingdom Minister of Arts and Science. We look forward to working with Emilo. Absolutely. Oh, so now we have some challenges for the kingdom. So the first challenge we have, because when things finally do get to reopen, masks are very clearly going to be a requirement. So the first thing we have is a challenge. We would like to see your heraldry. Your, you can decorate them however you want. We would love to see uh, Eldermere populous badges. This one here is, is just a simple basque made by um, Baroness Matilda. Uh, this is an iron-on um, wolf, but you can put your heraldry, kingdom badges, um, fun stuff. You could, if you make lace, maybe over top. We want to see some imaginative masks with your heraldry on them. So, and if you don't have heraldry, we have some heralds that would be willing to help you get that. I mean, they're, they got nothing to do right now, right? They're at home. They, I, if, I don't know if you can see Ryland, but she is just, please. So if you want to get some heraldry, reach out to our heralds. Uh, please make some amazing masks. And then once you've made your amazing masks, send a photo. You can take a picture of just the mask, or you can take a picture of you in garb wearing the mask. And if you could send it, um, 
his email address will be posted in the tidings and later online for you. If you could send it to Baron Alexander Gladstone, he is going to put together a compilation of the photos of the amazing heraldic masks that, uh, that you all uh, put together for us. So yeah, right. mask up guys. I look forward to seeing them much like on the battlefield to recognize uh, heraldry and who's on there. It'll be quite <laughs> nice to see the masks of the people of Elgin. That's amazing. So, for heraldic masks, what's that? What's that? Okay, so I get the fun one for me. <laughs> Earlier in the year, we alluded to Aldemir Light Cowboy. We are so excited. Um, the Aldemir Light Cavalry, we would like to see the children of Aldemir participating as messengers in events. Mm -hmm. uh, any way we can, any way they'd like to participate. Um, but to do that, they need a horse. And so what we've done, and again, uh, Baroness Matilda has been just instrumental in this, we're going to mail out a do your own, do it yourself <laughs> hobby horse. Yes. So we will mail anybody who sends us an address and how many horses they need. We will send you a hobby horse in the mail, which then you have to stuff and put a stick in. And we would really like to have another challenge. We're hoping that um, we can see the hobby horses get barding done. So what we'd like to do is see barding uh, cloth put over top of here and just be folded over and then put your heraldry or the kingdom heraldry if you like or, or decorated. anything you decorate it any way you want yep and we're hoping to have a well we can have yes, events again yes. we're hoping to have a uh, barding fashion show um and this can be done by yourself or can be done with your parents either way we'd love to see everybody participating and i'm really looking forward to seeing our Aldemir Light Calvary Games happen. So for the parents of our, our youth, if you could send us an email, um, the email address for the crown is on the Kingdom website. Send us an email, let us know how many um, children, youth that you have, how many uh, kits you will need, and your mailing address. We will mail you kits. Um, clearly without the sticks, because that's just not gonna fit in the mail very well. And for those who are kids at heart, you, you could email us as well, um, but just know that the children will get them first. I think that's the other question. Yeah, so I think we're, I think the only other things that we wanted to maybe talk about, because this is a, a, our first quarter, but it's a short one, um, is that um, if you haven't seen the announcement, we have the Kingdom of Events Europe. We are still going to do a gift exchange with them. So if you would like to participate that, in that, um, reach out to Baroness Ann Tinker. She's the one that's um, organizing our gift exchange with them. So reach out to her and she will uh, find out how you can contribute or she might have some ideas or things that she needs. And uh, last, oh, what else would you like to see us do? <laughs> we need ideas. We are we running. We love to hear from you. Eldemir at Home has been great. Um, yeah. Colin and Thorfina have been working on that very hard. Um, it's wonderful seeing all of the, uh, the things um, going on uh, among uh, like around the kingdom that people are doing but what do you want to see from us what would you like to see if we put together a little skit or maybe something for a future court um, we don't generally have a lot of events over the summer because people are expecting to be at Penzi so we will probably be doing more of these kind of things quick courts hopefully live streamed um, so what do you want to see from us send us some ideas because we would love to hear from you um, and award recommendations because although we aren't giving out um, other than scroll of honors and stuff although we aren't giving them out right now online uh, someday we will have events again and we would love to recognize everybody doing all the amazing things that we do. And, so. the, and the, the scribes keep telling me they're bored. Yes. Oh, our scribes need work. So send us those award recommendations. And I think, I think we're now.
uh, I think, yeah, we should, we should definitely thank the Story staff. Yeah. Um, it's been a weird year for a lot of events, and it's no exception for Toyo Mort. Uh, other than being this close to the sun as normal, uh, <laughs> we, uh, we, appreciate, uh, <laughs> we appreciate everything you've done uh, to try and keep the event going, because uh, Toyo Mort is near and dear to our hearts. It's near and dear to Elvenir. Um, we, we Toyo Mort was my first event. That's true. It's, Many years ago. So it's uh, what you've done to keep it going. We appreciate so much. Uh, you've done an amazing job. And I, I just like to hear Wassail from the kingdom. So Wassail, thank you. Wassail, Oldemar, thank you so very, very much. Rylan? There being no further business, this court is hereby closed. I believe something of a concert, your majesty? Oh, a concert, wonderful. Can I bring the horse? <laughs> a concert, your majesty. <laughs>